Guns with Fisherman here. Welcome back to another video. Um, can you guess where I'm at? Yeah, the lake. It's a beautiful morning. I'm on this little cove where I usually go to. It's like a go to spot every time I come to this lake. Uh, I've caught a few stuff out of here, maybe almost three pounders. Got one. Oh. On the turkey. Nice. Uh, I thought it was. Oh. On the jerky. That's a good one, bro. Well, I'm gonna try it again. Uh, water temp is about 76 degrees, so I don't know how where the fish is at. They're probably gonna be all around stacked on the sides or the edges, or they might be. Deep water. We'll see if we can snag some big and out of this. Uh, I brought four rods. So rod one is gonna be chatter bait. Then I got this Texas rig. Then have the buzz bait. Probably that's not gonna do any good. And I got a jerk bait. Probably that's not gonna do any good either. Uh, water clarity. It's pretty low. Maybe you have about a foot of visibility. You can see. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to rig up some dark colors like blue. Yeah. So the first runner up is going to be the chatterbait with the trail. The weather's nice and calm, not too windy out here. Perfect weather. Also, I'm in Oklahoma, so you know how that weather goes, either good or bad. It will change dramatically. It will be good one hour, then it will be storming next hour. Uh, sorry about my reel. My reel is making all this type of noise. I just need to clean it. My reel is not sounding too good. Thing about cleaning it, if you guys know how to clean it or has some tip tricks about cleaning the Abu Garcia Black Max reel, comment below and tell me how you guys do it. Or if there's an easy way or you guys take out the whole reel or you just clean parts of it. Yeah, cause that noise is like terrifying. Sounds like a garbage disposal, but hey, haven't had a chance to clean it yet. It, get, it gets the job done. So I'm just gonna cover a bunch of water, throwing this chatterbait in the middle. I smell gas. I hope I'm not leaking gas. You know, I don't think I'm leaking gas. Oh, I think I'm leaking oil or something. That's not good. Maybe I overfilled it. I'm gonna throw in this little code. Ah, oh, no way. No. Whoa, so at least my line's still on there. Okay, lost it all. Lost my chatterbait. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up my mess up. Wow. Okay. No, it only hurt my finger. Okay. Now what? We go to a different spot so i haven't had any fish shit or bite been out here for about an hour well in this particular spot about 30 minutes broke my rod chatterbaits got stuck that's a lesson guys if your bait or hook gets stuck do not just yank on it with the pole trying to pull it from the line lesson learned i 
Hey, you never know until you try it. Learn from mistakes. To a different spot. That is our first fish of the day. Oh, guys, we have a first fish of the day. What is this? Okay, I can dig that. First fish of the day out of Cinco. Little squeakers. Caught that little squeaker with this thing. Let's go see if there's another squeaker. Oh, what the heck? We got another squeaker. I didn't even feel that. Oh. I didn't even feel that bite. Man, that's two. I guess they're all stacked over here. Little squeakers, man. Get on the boat. Got us another squeaker. It's about to come off. That's three. Still a squeaker, but I'll take it. I'll take squeakers anytime. Oh, you see that? Acrobat dance. All right, I'm about to get out of here now. update we'll say we did good not too bad but not great but some days it could be better catching fish beats any day being skunk okay uh caught three squeakers on a senko tried throwing the chatterbait buzz bait jerk bait and jig head uh no, none of the fish even tried to attempt to bite on those for some reason caught them was the uh the senko five inch senko watermelon candy color weightless Oh, I don't know why. I always fish weightless. What do you guys think? Comment below if you guys do a Texas rig with bullet weight. But it seems like I catch more fish with the weightless. I guess the weather. The weather is about 72 degrees. Not too sunny. It's overcast. So I tried doing the bullet weight Texas rig sink up. Never have any chance of catching anything. But when I, as soon as I took that bullet weight off and did it weightless, that's when the bite started kicking in. I don't know. So comment below what you think if you guys usually fish bullet weight. Senko Texas rig or weightless.
But weightless to me seems to do pretty good every time. That's either the lake or the pond. Overall, it's a good day. Highly appreciate it if you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video, share the video. It'll give me influence of making more videos. But other than that, it was, it was a good day. <laughs>